Have you ever wondered if the Ethereum altcoin season is upon us? With Ethereum ETFs causing ripples in the cryptocurrency world, may believe that an altcoin boom could follow a little suit. But hold your horses, my beer readers. Let me tell you a tale of two indicators that paint a different picture. Now, first off, let me introduce you to our trusted friend, the ETH BTC ratio. Analysts argue that whenever Ethereum outperforms Bitcoin in terms of this ratio, uh, it usually sparks rally among altcoins. Crypto Nova, uh, a well-known uh, uh, figure in the community, even goes so far as to say, when Ethereum goes up, the entire altcoin market follows. And um, but wait, what does Michael Van de Pot, another respected voice in the industry, think about this? He agrees with Nova and adds his own perspective, stating, as long as Ethereum stays above 0.05%, BTC, we've got ourselves a new trend upwards. So now, imagine having one ETH being equal to half a Bitcoin sounds exciting, doesn't it? Well, as of now, the ETH bit C ratio stands at approximately uh, 0 0.055. If it jumps up, it may signal good news for Ethereum and potentially the whole altcoin market. Um, Yet here comes a twist in our little story. Enter the altcoin season index, a crucial indicator that provides valuable insights into the altcoin market's behavior. Currently, it's reading, it sits at 37, indicating that an altcoin season isn't quite ready to make its entrance just yet. The index suggests that 75% of altcoins need to outperform Bitcoin within the last 90 days for an alt season to occur. It's important to note that not every altcoin behaves equally during these market conditions. While mean coins, such as Pepe and Dogafat, have seen impressive gains plus 950% and plus 150% others, but also if you have an investor from the 100 by positive and the 200% positive that is rest and multiple after months if you haven't in the four story and the start of the year. So why uh, the discrepancy between these altcoins? Deribit, a uh, leading derivatives exchange, sheds light on the situation. They explain that the oversupply of token unlocks could be contributing to the token's lackluster performance of certain projects. In fact, $82 million worth of OP tokens were released onto the market, followed closely by almost the same amount of ARB. Last but not least, remember that not all altcoins will experience growth if the ETH BTC ratio increases. It seems that the market may favor specific altcoins over others, making the selection process vital for investors. So keep an eye on those promising projects and stay tuned for further developments. Well, with that said, thanks for joining me on this journey through the fascinating world of cryptocurrencies. Until next time, Oh, and don't forget, they call it altcoin season because sometimes holding an unpopular coin can feel like waiting for spring.